Hello and welcome, my name is Easy, and this is The Darkest Dungeon. We have arrived at week 15, after successfully killing the Swine Prince. Kuchi is no longer hopeless and has recovered 70 stress, that's quite nice. Bonafant recovered 56 stress. Pericard, Orber and Mansell have all achieved adventurer level and are now level 2. And this is the rundown of the successful dungeon against the Swine Prince, which we absolutely destroyed. And then we kill his little buddy Wilbur as well. So, let's see. Let's check if there is finally a Vestal waiting for us. No, of course there's not. Okay, well guys, I'm very sorry that you all came over here in the hopes of joining the awesome crusade that we're holding against the dungeon dwellers. I guess. Uh, but yeah, bye. I need a vessel. Let's dive to the guild. Let's see if there are any skills that I want to upgrade on anyone. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Uh, you're definitely not where I want you to be. I think I'll just straight upgrade everything on you. In fact, we might actually just... Yeah, reduce the price. Why not? Every creature has a weakness. The wise hero trains for what she will face. And we are quite wise, so we're gonna train. Increased accuracy is always nice and a little bit of crit. Retribution is definitely just something we're gonna upgrade because we use it all the time. I don't actually use command all that often, but I do like bolster, so we'll upgrade that as well. And why not upgrade crush? I mean, we don't use it a lot, but when we do, it's nice that it does better everything, actually. We're just gonna leave it at that. Let's go check on Derville. Pond, how are you looking? Pond's fully upgraded. Menzel. Orba, how are you doing, buddy? The curse has been absolutely amazing for me. So I'll just upgrade this. You know what? I don't really care that much about it. Let's leave it as it is. Uh, our sniper, we're definitely going to upgrade. We will definitely upgrade this one. As well as the blind fire. As well as the battlefield bandage. And then we got Kunshi. We will definitely upgrade your weird reconstruction, obviously, because that's our go to skill. Abyssal Hands, that has a stun attack the front two is actually quite nice let's just upgrade that as well we'll just leave it at this still got more than enough money left but that's fine let's check out what adventures are available to us we can if we like go kill the necromancer apprentice i think we'll actually go with that one what else do we have available a sun ring seems to be a very good item especially since i'm running with high torch level most of the time it's a medium level so we'll get some camping complete 100 percent of the room battles uh, now, I would like to bring uh, Derville again. Let's just have a quick look at this. Shall we just keep going with Orba? I do like Orba quite a bit. Uh, that maybe I should actually go with Kunsh instead. And then I can bring my Plague Doctor. And then I will bring, I think, my Men at Arms. So we've got some healing. We've got a little bit of healing, a little bit of stress relief. We've got some buffs and we've got some blindness. I think this is the group we will roll with let's just do it so medium mission let's bring um, I'll bring 16 food 16 that's 16 all right and I will bring 12 torches I'll bring a shovel and that will be it the fiends must be driven back and what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line so, 100% of room battles. Well, let's start by going the only way we can. Let's start moving. Let's kill these bugs. Uh, a bit short. Two damage. Roosted is the after effect, but took some stress damage. Nice dodge there. They all go before I go. Another dodge, very nice. Okay, let's see about start to starting to kill some stuff. They are a hundred percent resistant to blight, so that's off the table, sadly. I could go for a stun in the back, but I honestly don't care that much about it. I'm gonna buff my uh, crusader. Who will in turn use the zealous accusation to kill two when he does. Fiend. And then my men at arms, 90% is. Well, it's, they're both 90. Let's just go for this one. Press this job. advantage. Quite Give them nice. no quarter. Alright. I'll 
I have my cultists interact with the bookshelf. Found a map. Okay, that is very nice to have. Oh, this is some weird scouting. Usually it's the first couple of rooms with the hallways towards those, but this time it's not the case. Uh, we're still at plus two, so let's just move in. And fight. Tempting goblet. Don't mind that too much. Another one. Oh, that one was. Two more damage on the men at arms. Alright, my turn. Uh, should I start healing already? No, I don't think so. No, let's just go for additional artillery. Can we. We do have a fair chance of killing, well, one at least. Let's just try it. Nice one. And then we will. I could actually finish him off. Or oh, we could go for the blight. They're not overly resistant to blight. So let's go for this one. Uh, that's not going to be enough to finish him off. No. Maybe I should go for the kill then. Yep. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Oh, he gets to go again. Nice. Five damage on this one. This will finish him. This will almost guarantee the kill. Let's go for this one. Confidence oh, nice. surges as the enemy crumbles. All right, well, let's finish him with a noxious blast then. A trifling victory. I'll take but that. A victory, nonetheless. You can open the effect of that. Oh, hidden treasure. Very nice. Are we getting more scouting? Sadly not. Let's move along down here. Uh, I'll let the occultist delve to the bookshelf again. They are dull and uninteresting. Let's move along. You're dull. Another fight. Ooh, okay, not too happy with that. Graveyard slash, five damage, not too bad. Uh, oh, you can actually do more from over here. That's kind of strange. Uh, am I going to stun something? Am I going to try to kill something? Mm, I'm not going to be able to kill something. 17% crit chance is fair, but probably not enough. I didn't pay. Oh! Oh, okay, I think I get it now. These little markers to the side indicate who's still to go this round. Right, if that's the case, that's massive. Nice done there. Wow, it's it's useful every once in a while just looking at what's going on. I'm not sure if you can do something from back there, but I'm fairly sure you can't do anything from all the way. Well, you can inspire. whoop de doo So if I buff someone, I should buff you. Uh, how much? How, well, you can move one space back. That's not going to help me an awful lot. Disorienting blast is just—it doesn't do anything for me. So I'm going to buff my men at arms. Oh, we can't do anything from back there. Okay, that's good to know. I'll have you do some... It's four stress heal as well, so let's do that on the man arms. Although maybe I should have moved you up. How, how much... You can move two forward. Uh, that's actually not a really bad idea, is it? Nah, I'll try to go for the kill here. Ooh, almost, but not quite. Okay, new round. Yeah, it is, it is. These little markers indicate who already went this round. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, like I said, just go for the kill here. And we're gonna go for another stun. Uh, we're gonna stun the, this one, the soldier. Very nice. Bump in the night, five damage. My plate doctor's not quite happy right now. Well, I don't think he is, at least. I'll uh, buff, I think I'll buff you, actually. We'll be doing some more stress relief from the back. There's a bump in the night. Four more damage. Yeah, he's, he's really not too thrilled about this. We're going to try to finish this fella, which we do. I'll move you forward right now. Bump in the night on the man at arms. And a dodge. Very nice. 
Sadly, no retaliation, but it will have to do. Let's see if we can get really lucky. Oh, not, it's a 1% crit chance, so that's not going to happen. We'll do some more stress relief. You're on 33, you're on 35. Let's do the occultist. And the occultist should be in a position where he can actually use his healing ability now. Three damage. Nothing to worry about too much. Let's go for it. Resisted and 12. That is massive. Uh, we're going to go for another noxious blast. He's going to be dead the next time he acts, but he is going to act this round, so I'm just going to finish him off with this. Which I didn't need to do, but yeah, okay, maybe I should actually pay more attention. See if we can finish this fight. Executed we can. Executed with impunity. Okay, let's move you back to the front, and you two seem to be doing all right in the positions you are at. I think for you it doesn't really matter all that much. All the way to back. Oh, you can't use your. Wait, hold on a second. Uh, what is this back? Th Three, back two, or any, any. Maybe I should just move you to, like so. Then you can use your second. Uh, yeah, this this seems to be better. Let's move along. I will light a torch before we enter this room. Nothing but emptiness. All right, let's move back to where we came. Dum 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 dum. -dum, -dum. And continue on this way. Did I actually interact with that? Yeah, I did. I think. Oh, unsettling pages. I don't like that. Well, passage. But apparently, he's a really quick reader. No surprises. There are surprises, but not on my side. I think I'll just go for the stabby stabby stuff. I like stabbing stuff. Okay, that didn't really help me any. Uh, noxious Blast, I should Blight Resistance. It's not really great or anything. I'll just go with you. He's been finished off. Very nice. You can kill that one. And that will leave me with the Crusader. And you can kill that one. If you actually manage to hit it. Alright, Noxious Blast. If I do 4 damage, it will be dead. I do not do 4 damage, it will not be dead. Because it also resists it. Bite. And another dodge on my side. That's good news. Maybe, 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 maybe. Well, they're both still going to go. Uh, I was actually hoping that he would go, so I could do a little bit of stress relief, but apparently that's not going to be the case. So, we'll do a bit of healing. He's suffering five wounds. Five wounds. Wow, he's only got 16 hit points, really. Uh, and seven wounds. We'll, we'll go for you. Oh, bleeding too. Okay, that's bad. Yeah, that's not what I... Wait, did I just completely... Yeah, I think I just foobarred. I don't know, whatever. I'm not going to use... No, I'm just going to finish him. If he hit, and he does. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Right, nice room. Let's see what we find. Another fight. More spiders. And these are surprised as well. Lucky me. You get to go first. How much damage does this do? I oh, can only hit the one. Oh, should I? Should I go for the stun? Is this a stun? No, this is not a stun. It's just a double head. Let's go for the double head. Oh, minimum damage. Alright. Well, it is what it is. I could go for the double stun in the back if I'd like. And then kill these. Have these two kill these two. Yeah, let's do that. Let's not give him a chance to uh, attack me back. Unless one resists, of course. Uh, there's always that. He might actually be able to kill one outright, but let's just go for the uh, fairly certainty of... Oh my god, another dodge, really. Now, I almost feel as if I have to do a retribution. He's stunned, so I'm definitely not going to attack him. Just attack him. Crit. Nice crit. Get some stress relief, but not on the occultist, sadly. They're probably going to go first now. Oh, no, they're not. Okay, he's already stunned. Uh, might be able to finish him. Need to do four or more damage. Another dodge. Okay. Well, that kind of sucks. 
Uh, no, go for the single target, high damage. Another crit, wow. Again, no stress relief on the occultist though. Does he have some sort of affliction where he doesn't actually enjoy other people killing stuff? Another dodge, wow, this is just, oh, mental. I can't, oh, no, I can actually hit him. Well, let's just go for this one then. We resisted it again. This little spider here in the back has proven to be quite a nuisance. Okay, I want to check this out real quick. You're stressy then in a tippler. Why do you not enjoy someone else scoring a critical? Why? I don't get it. Right, let's finish this one off. And you get to take out this one. Quite nice. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. I'll have you open it, and it's trapped, and you resisted it. Damnations, are you going to take stress from that? Nope. Uh, no scouting again, but this is the only way we can go. So let's hope we don't run into any traps. More undead. And we got surprised. Wow, second time this dungeon. That's a bit of a surprise. The heal or the damage? Let's go for the damage. Not going to kill anything, but let's just soften them up a little bit. I think I'll have you buff my Crusader. Here comes the quarrel. I have no quarrel with you. Why are you shooting at me up in the night? Three damage. Yeah, you're in the front row again. They do enjoy murdering you if you're in the front row. I might actually do him... Well, nah, I, I need to score a crit in order to actually set him up for the kill for my men at arms. But So, yeah. I, I'll just go for the bone rep. Okay, if I had known... If I had known... I wasn't paying attention, wasn't I? I didn't need a critical. I might be able to... Well, if I score a crit, I will be able to kill this one. Uh, let's try it. Wow. Massive. Still, no stress relief on the occultist. Dead weight. That will push him back. Unless he resists it, which he does. It doesn't stun him either, so shouldn't complain about that. Let's do some weight reconstruction on my light doctor. Bleeding in three, so that doesn't give me anything. Dead weight again. Okay, now he could push back a little bit. Doesn't really help me or anything, but still. Your turn. Let's go for a retribution, or should I go for a dodge instead? Nah, go for the uh, retribution. Five damage. And you can go for massive damage. Twelve. No, not bad. You're gonna get out of your stun. Eventually, there you go. Round. Okay, let's try that thing again where I bleed you and try to heal you and then mess up horribly one. Wow, well at least it's not bleeding even more. Shall I have you... No, I don't need to buff, let's just do this. Uh, I believe he's dead. Yeah, when he goes, he's dead. Um, okay, I don't need to finish him off. So maybe my Crusader will go first. He does, that's good. Let's give you a little bit of stress relief. And there goes the final the enemy. Victory. Perhaps the turning point. Oh, what's this? Plus 20 bleed chance, minus 5 damage, and a hellion. Hmm. I don't actually know why you would want that, but alright. Take it. Let's move you back to where you're supposed to be. And we can continue along. I'll have you open the sack. The contents are yours. Wow, 25 gold. Whoever left that was out of his mind. Or her skull. Oh, another fight. And another surprise. Wow, there's a lot of surprises going on here. Either I'm surprised or they're surprised. So many surprises. Let's go for the blinding gas in the back. Both hit. Both have been stunned, so that is good news for me. Um, not going to soften the back row up. I should actually go for the heal, shouldn't I? Let's go that. Oh, yeah, resist 12. This is exactly what we'd like to see. You're going to go for the straight-up damage. Might actually kill him, and you do. Very nice. 
And now you're going to go for the damage on the Bone Defender, 13, quite nice as well. They come out of this stun. I'm going to do a... Mm, like this is, I can't actually hit you. Uh, I'll do it on you, 4 damage, that's pretty nice. And Blight it, that's not bad. Then it's your turn to go. Shall we, shall we, shall we? If I do five or more damage, she's going to be dead before she gets a chance to act. But she already acted this round, so instead we're going to go for you. Alright, you get the chance to finish this guy. Six damage, how much damage? Four damage. Okay, let's just do a crush. Very good. And now it is your turn. You're the final one to go this round. Uh, this will kill if it hits. And this will kill if it hits. I think I'd like to go for you, actually. Let's do that. 19 massive damage there. Ooh, I'm getting real lucky here. And another kill. This expedition at least promises success. Ooh, and some scouting. That's always nice to get. There's a trap in the next hallway. Hmm... I'll do that with... I shouldn't do that with you, should I? It's a locked display cabinet. I got a key. If Aha. only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. Oh, hunger. Alright, let's eat. Here comes the trap. I got no idea who's got the best percentage to actually trap 10. Trap 30. Alright, it's probably you then. 20. 25. All right, man at arms. Go. Oh, very nicely done. A little bit of stress relief as well. Let's fire up another torch before we enter this room. 90. Very good. Ooh. No surprises this time. I'm okay with that. Yeah. I don't really mind too terribly. Uh, 47. 47. I got an 80% hit chance with a 17 crit chance. Let's go for... Yeah, let's go for the Bone Soldier. Alright, 4 damage, alright. Run for the old gods. Ouch! Resist the bleed though. Don't like the stress. Tempting Goblet on the Men at Arms. Reeling. Ooh, more stress. Eldritch Push. Please resist that. Please resist that. Please resist that. That's a damn shame. Okay, we're gonna go for the double stun in the rear. Eat this. And she resisted. Not happy with that. Graveyard slash. Oh, Such critical. a terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. Hmm, don't like the way this is suddenly turning around. Uh, this is gonna kill you. Let's go for that. Okay, I think I will actually give you a little bit. Nah, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I just should just move you about. So you can use your weird reconstruction. And you probably won't get attacked as much if you're over there instead of where you were. I might actually have a kill here. He's stunned. Let's go for her. Dodge. That's a shame. Alright, you're going to do a self-heal. Resist and zero. Okay, well that happens as we have just seen. Let's go for her again. Eight. Sadly not enough. Eldritch push. Please resist it this time. Good. Your turn. I think you will finish her. Unless she dodges. Tempting Goblin. Except my man at arms. I'm not too worried about that. Not yet at least. Run for the old gods. Not too worried about that either. It is bleeding though. Stressful incantation. Okay. This... This... Encounter is not going too well for me. Resist and again zero. Really, wow, that is amazing luck. Or the complete lack of it. Um, you've all gone already. I think I will just do this. I said this accusation will take you out and it will do you some recent damage. Quite good. And I'm gonna have you try to finish off the courtier, which you don't manage to do. Right, your turn. Um, finish off this little bugger. You 
going round. Rent for the old gods. Right, I've got four guys all allowed to go before he does. Um, if I hit him, I might kill him, so we're not going to do that. Instead, we're going to buff whoever, because that really doesn't matter. What does matter is... Okay, this is a bit of a shame as well. I actually had hoped that someone else would go before you. Uh, let's increase our dodge chance and our speed. So we'll probably go before he goes next round as well. I'm going to have you do an inspiring cry on the occultist. For stress relief, that's nothing to complain about. Um, again, same as before. I'm actually using this guy now to get my party back up to some health. Five, that's more like it. Uh, will this actually kill him? Oh yeah, that would definitely kill him. Okay, we're gonna increase our dodge even further. Because, you know, why not? Dodge. Nah! You're gonna do another stress heal? Inspiring cry, again, on the occultist. I guess this is kind of cheating, isn't it? Oh well! Uh, you still got nine wounds. Let's do it one more time. Eight. Okay, perfect. I'm very pleased with that. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna keep doing this one more round and get some heals on my uh, men at arms. Uh, extra heals, or should I do a stressy one? It's two to three. Let's just do this. Run for the old gods. Four damage and bleed. Okay, maybe I'm not gonna do it on him. See, that's when you do this shit. The game just gives you the finger, and then this happens. Okay, we're gonna do a heal on the crusade instead. Resisted and one. Yeah, this is definitely the game giving me the finger. Uh, you know what? Screw it. Oh, hold on. He went. Uh, I still have the crusader that goes. Okay, so that's not gonna help me. I will just kill him. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. A blightstone. That looks kind of creepy. We've got another shovel and another key. And okay, that's the adventure if we want. And we're going to get scouting as well. That is really nice. Okay, let me just scroll out a little bit. I believe these darker blue ones are obstructions. So I've got two shovels right now, so that will be just fine. Uh, I'll have you interact with this. Eldritch Altar, you, you got that Eldritch thing going. Dedicated to unholy abominations. Perhaps a great power lies within. Let's try it. Purely decorative, okay. But somehow that's now covered in blood. Details, details. I think I should go this way rather than that way. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna go down this way. I'll have you. Interact with the confession booth. The heroes are absolved of his sins. Clumsy quirk removed. That is really nice. Was that the uh, minus dodge? It was, wasn't it? Yeah, I believe it was. I can actually carry more treasure, can't I? Yeah, I can. I can. Okay. Let's just keep on moving. Oh, I don't have to move like that. I need to move like so. I'll fire up another torch. Here's the trap. Man at arms time. Time to shine. He does it again. Wow, I'm, I'm very impressed. Another bookcase. Shall I have you... Actually, I'm going to let you read that this time. They are dull and uninteresting. Okay. Well, it is what it is. Uh, you can open this. Stashed heirlooms. Where? Very nice. So, we've got another empty room. Let's not linger. Well, I'm trying to enter it, but you're interrupting me. Then we have a fight coming up in this hallway. I'll have you... I'm going to go with you again. Absolved of a sin. The anemic quirk has been removed. Wow, this is really good. Let's fire up another torch because we've got an encounter coming up right ahead of us. 82, here we go. Ooh, bandits. Blanket fire. Okay, I was going to say I don't mind that unless it's crits. Then I suddenly do. Then I minded a whole lot. 
Uh, let's go for this guy. No crit, sadly, but high damage. Another blanket fire. Please no. Okay, dodging. Very many, many dodges there. Uppercut slice. Is that a knockback? It is, but that's not really a problem for me. Not in that position, at least. Shank. Plague Doctor. He's bleeding. Uh, I don't really think that matters that much. I should probably finish this one off. Or can I finish this guy off? No, I need to crit in order to do that. Let's go for this one. He's very dead. Then I could do a blinding gas on the remaining fusilier, which I will. He has been stunned. Now I should go for the pure damage output here. Might actually kill one. Sadly I don't. But he's gonna die on the next attack. Which you are going to pump out. Do I need to heal? No, I do not need to heal, so let's just go for the damage. A nice critical. Strike. And finally he got some stress relief. And I'm going to try to murder you, which probably will. Okay, crit. Nice crit. Again, no stress relief on the occultist. I'm not understanding why he's not getting stress relief from someone else crits. Okay, let's try to finish this fella. Maybe I should have gone for the stress relief on my occultist there. Yeah. Bit silly, I guess. He's dead. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. I'm carrying too many things. And now that I finally think about it, I do still have my firewood. Oh yeah, right. I can't actually look at what's going on when well, on the map if this thing is open. Do I want both of these? I, I do. Yeah, I do. Uh, plus 10 scouting, minus 10 speed on the first round. Okay, I don't really care about that. I'm going to remove you. And I think I'll remove you as well, or possibly you. Let's remove this one. And I'll camp in this room. Focus uh, for as much as possible on stress relief, which is probably going to suck again, but we'll see. A moment of respite. A chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. I think I'm actually going to stop after this uh, because I'll only have one food left and I don't actually want to run into starvation because that would really screw me right over. Let's see, you got uh, heal, heal, and one companion blight resist, bleed resist, seed resist. Yeah, that's not going to help me at all. This is reduced stress by 25. This is really good actually. This is increased stress by 15, so we're not going to do that. Wound care, extra dodge, huge buffs on some character. We got stress resist and reduce stress by 25. I'm going to do that as well. And how much time do we have left? Eight. Seeing as I don't need to heal, uh, but I might get surprised. I'm going to do this. Increase the dodge in case we do get surprised. And we will do wound care on the men at arms. And then I think we'll do wound care on the crusade as well. And that will be this. Oh, they are upon us indeed. They found us. Sneaky bastards. Ambush. Uh, this is a fairly bad surprise. It's not the worst possible one. But it's close to it. Let's just go for the kill. A little lucky there. Very good. Dodge. Nice dodge. Very nice. Uh, I'll have you do some stress relief on the artist. Right in the middle. Another dodge. Very nice. I guess I'll move you back instead. Not sure about this one in all honesty. I'll go for the straight up damage. I might kill, but I might get a lucky blow. Nice stress relief there. Am I gonna go first? I am. Am I gonna be able to finish? Most likely. No! Oh so close, so so close. Maybe I'll get another dodge. I did. 
see that extra dodge chance is pretty, pretty good. The way is lit. The path is clear. So we you're going to go back only there. the strength to follow it. Uh, this is it, yeah? Yeah, this is it. I, I did just camp. I did just eat. I should be alright for another two hallways, shouldn't I? Okay, I'm gonna have you try to disarm. I get he disarms here. Wow, this guy's on a roll. Nothing good can come of interacting with this. Nothing. Nothing at all. But we're gonna do it anyway. <gasps> Stash loot, yes. Oh, one on in 25. Hmm, okay. A map. Well, I'd hope for something else, but it is what it is. Okay, final hallway. So if I'm not mistaken, we will have a bit of a pile of rocks here. Yes, indeed. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Maybe I I'll, will risk it and go for that one as well. Let's see if you can find more of those. Uh, knowledge within changes the hero forever. Oh, okay, that's nice. Definitely nice. Yeah, well, I'm going to go for this last one. I mean, I might just get the uh, the hungry event right now, but I shouldn't. Should I? Okay, nothing to worry about. All right, we're done. More bones return to rest. Devils remanded to their abyss. Yeah. And you know how I am with these things. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. I thought I was going to get four in a row. That would have been amazing. Plus 15 stun resist. That is really good. Last gasp. Below 50% health. Extra speed. Tough. Plus 10 max health straight up. Minus 20 stress resist if torch is above 75. Okay, that's quite weird. And 15 move resist. I like that. I hope you enjoyed this video and will consider leaving a like. Feel free to post any comments in the section down below, and I hope to see you again next time. In the darkest dungeon.